there what's up i hope that you're fine wherever you are so today is on the 25th of december it is christmas day but i don't have much to do i've been under the weather for the last uh, three to four days i'm not feeling well i just want to share with you how our day is going to look like so here i have something that i want to show you so look at this so this is wheat flour and it is the brown one so what i'm doing i'm preparing chapati using the uh, the brown flour we are trying to keep it healthy and that is why i'm using this so please spend the day with me as we do some of the activities i just want to share with you how my day looks like the kids are out there playing i'm here in my mother's kitchen as usual i just want to do the cooking and then uh, later on i'm going to relax and just let the day flow the way it is so come along with me as i showcase how this is done so let me adjust my camera so let me bring it closer as usual my son is the one who helps me to shoot most of my videos but this being a Christmas day, you can't get him. He is out there, he wants to play with his friends. And there's nothing much I can do about it, other than to come up with a way of just surviving. Hey, creating content is not easy. You can imagine, like you need to set your camera. So here we are. This is the first one. I'm going to place it there. So this is how I usually make my chapatis. Sprinkle a little of flour so that it doesn't become sticky to the surface. So how is your Christmas? Have you gone to church? If you have not gone to church, what is your plan with family? What are you going to do? Are you going to go out later on in the day? So for me, I don't think if I'll get out of the of this place because of how I am feeling I'm not feeling okay so I'm not feeling that okay and the medication that I'm taking is kind of strong it's putting me a little bit it's making me feel a little bit tired but again I have to prepare this for the family and the reason is because I don't have anyone around to help me. So I need to prepare this meal for my parents, my nephews, and my kids. I need to do this. So I hope your Christmas is going on well. And I hope your 2023 is wrapping on well. How has your 2023 been in terms of relationships, finance, you know, your spiritual nourishment, socialization and all that? How has it been? So here in, here in Kenya, we have a lot of challenges and especially the economy. The economy is so tough. Like everything is very, very expensive. I wonder... Actually, I'm, I'm not wondering. I'm grateful to God that we can at least afford to make such a meal. You know, this one is a delicacy. And especially while I was growing up, this used to be a delicacy. Like, it was, chapati was not something that we would eat, like, every day. It was something that was not that... The wheat flour itself was very expensive. Don't know it is expensive. But I think because of a lot of changes, we are working, like we have, like have, almost everyone in the family is working. So getting uh, wheat flour is not that hard. So my 2023 has been good. And I can't complain a lot. It has been so, so good. And I thank God for it. I've had a lot of time just to discover myself and to 
bond with my kids and my family. Yeah, and my family members. And I'm so grateful for it. I've had a few challenges. I had a I had an accident. And that is why I have this scar here. Ma! Yes, Ma! baby. And I'm gone, yeah. So I had a, it was a minor accident, though it left me with this car. And then, just recently, while preparing Smoky for the family, again, <laughs> I was burnt by cooking oil. So the, I think this has been my major setback. Mom. Yes, baby. It has been my major setback, but I hope... I'm going to heal well, and everything is going to work. Mom, mom. Yes, baby. So this year, I think my major setback has been injuries. I've had two major injuries, so let me show you. I have a scar here. I hope that it will eventually heal well, and I'll get my complexion back. I fell down while carrying my daughter. I think I shared that one with you. And then just recently, a few days ago, let me adjust my camera. So a few days ago, while preparing Smoky for the family, I don't know what happened. Guys, I can't tell. Oil just splashed. Yeah, the cooking oil splashed on me. And this is the outcome. And I hope that it is uh, going to be, it's not going to be that bad. So I think those are the two things that ha, the the two things that have made my 2023 to be a bit a bit bad if I can say that. But all is going to be well. So I need to cover it this way because I want to prepare chapati and of course I'm using the hot surface. And because of the hot surface, I'll need to cover it so that it doesn't get that uh, it doesn't injure further so that is what i'm going to do so let me turn my camera and show you so even before i turn my cameras already i have some well prepared round chapatis that i want to place on the cooking pan what i usually do i always ensure that the cooking pan has uh, heated well so that when i start making the chapatis like it doesn't take a lot of time and then there's an art that i learned from my brother my brother Geoffrey. So I think one day I'll bring him over to the video so that you can see him. So I'll, uh, he taught me how to cook more than one chapati at a go. So sometimes I can do up to six. Yeah. So over there I have my cooking pan. It's very hot as you can see. Though my jiko is not well lit, I think there are some sticks that are still inside. Yeah. So that is my first chapati. So please watch the video up to the end. Remember to like it and subscribe if you've not done so. Bye-bye.